Ladies and gentlemen, if you need to pay your BPI credit card with the BPI app on your device, I'm going to show you exactly how to actually get it done. It's relatively quick and easy, so stick close and let's get into it. So the first thing you want to do is go ahead and open your BPI app. The next thing you're going to do is make sure that you have logged in. All right, so here is our home page. And we're going to go over to the right hand side to the more tab. Now, right at the top, you will find settings. And from here, we're going to go ahead and tap on that. And all the way at the bottom, you will find a manage favorites. All right. From here, we're going to go ahead and tap on add new favorites. Let's go ahead and tap on this box on the top here. And right at the bottom, you will see some options. And we want to choose the option billers. So over here, you're going to go ahead and select your biller. You can also go ahead and type it in if you don't want to look through the list. And you are going to choose the BPI Express Card Corp. And it's the very top one. It's the BECC. All right. And then you are going to add your reference number over here, which will be your customer number. You'll find this on your account statement. And from here, we're going to go ahead and tap on continue. From this page over here, you'll see all of your details and you are just going to go and click on confirm. So at the top, you'll see it says favorite added successfully. It's got all details and at the bottom, you'll see the pay bill option. Let's go ahead and tap on that. Over here, you will have to select the account that you are paying from, which is the very first option. And just below that, it is the pay to. Of course, we've already chosen that in the past. Uh, we created an account and we're going to go ahead and choose that, which will be the BECC. You'll go ahead and look on your account statement for the amount again that you uh, need to pay. And you're going to go and enter that amount. And then if you scroll all the way down to the bottom, you will find a continue button. You're going to tap on that. And on the next page, you will see all of your details. And uh, here you can just confirm that everything is correct, all the amounts and so forth. And you're going to tap on confirm. All right. And here we go. We've got a bills payment was successful. We've now successfully paid our credit card. I hope this video was helpful.